Not going to be nearly as bad as we've seen. I mean, triple digits, 110 degree heat indices over the past few days. That's going to be a thing of the past here for us. You look right now, not a lot going on out there. We had some showers and thunderstorms earlier on. Those have since pushed eastward. You can still see a flash flood warning in effect south of Dubuque there. But there were actually a couple confirmed tornadoes out near Farley, Iowa. And that cell thankfully weakened by the time it reached Dubuque. But those storms definitely left their impact by way of rain out there. Some of us saw upwards of four inches through extreme northeastern portions of the state. You look out there right now, though, it looks awfully dry. It's got a sticky feel, though, 94 still as we head into the evening hours here. But by tomorrow morning, temperatures dropping down into the mid 70s. A chancy spot of a shower or a thunderstorm. After that, temperatures climb back up to 90 degrees. And even though we'll be sitting at 90, it's going to feel a lot more like 95. So thankfully not into the triple digits. Futurecast tries to bring in some scattered showers and thunderstorms northeast of the metro overnight and race those eastward. So it could be a glancing blow of a few showers for us as those continue to push off to the southeast into the morning hours. South of Ottumwa, passing chance at a sprinkle. Uh, you look into the afternoon and evening hours. Skies clear out, bring in a bit of sunshine out there. So tonight, don't plan on much unless you're headed out into the early morning hours when we could see that passing shower or thunderstorm. 76 degrees tomorrow starting off to the southeast for showers and thunderstorms. 90 degrees for your high temperature and you look across the rest of the state much more manageable. 83 for Algona, 85 Decorah. Areas off to the southwest sitting in the mid to upper 80s and really good news. Heat index values climbing into the mid 90s. You look Hardly, well, no triple digit heat index values across the entire state. So, areas of the southeast taking the brunt of this, though, mid to upper 90s for your heat index as you head throughout the day. So, still another day to stay hydrated, but thankfully that excessive heat is behind us, at least for the near term here. Nine for your UV index, though, coat that uh, sunscreen on as you head out and about. Otherwise, you might catch a little bit of a burn there. Uh, and over the next few days here, we waffle around 90 degrees, 90 with sunshine on Monday, 89 on Tuesday. Tuesday. After that, scattered chances for showers and thunderstorms. Wednesday lingering into the beginning of the weekend. A look at Friday. Highs dropping into the low 80s for your Friday.